I felt like I was going mad. No one else could see what was going on. I never thought anything like this could happen to me. Coercive control is a pattern of deliberate abuse, over time leaving the victim intimidated, dependent and isolated. It can be hard to see, but coercive control is a crime. He's such a handsome man. When we were first married, he charmed everyone. I felt so lucky. I couldn't put my finger on when it changed. It wasn't one thing he did. It happened bit by bit. Why are you wearing that dress? I could never predict what would upset him. Those heels, I can't stand the sound they make. From the outside, we look like the perfect couple, a teacher married to a doctor. But inside, I feel like a hostage. He told me who I'm allowed to talk to and who I'm not allowed to talk to. And then he acted like it was all just a joke. It wasn't. He's deadly serious. He gets the kids to tell him who I see and where I go. He told me he'd put hidden cameras in the house to watch me when no one's there. After I passed my accountancy exams, I had a good salary. But he controlled every penny I spent. He even kept a spreadsheet. In the supermarket, I'd stand in front of the cereals scared stiff about what he might do if I chose the wrong kind. He complains that I don't call him enough, then that I call him too much. He gets into my email and deletes things, and he sends messages from my account. You're a useless mother. You get everything wrong. You're losing it. The way he undermines me, it, it makes me doubt myself. What if I make mistakes in front of the class? Is it all in my head? He'd smash a plate right beside me and then laugh at me when I flinched. He knew he didn't have to hit me to keep me under control. He'd get angry, then apologise. You know I love you. But you make me lose my temper. It's your fault. I thought I'd be safe if I towed the line. He kept coming to see me at my work, to check up on me. My colleagues thought it was sweet that he was so attentive. He told them... She needs a lot of attention. She's a wee bit... unstable. I felt too ashamed to tell them what's going on at home. So I left my job. It's like I don't know who I am anymore. It got so I couldn't go out at all. Not even into the garden. He'd hide my medication to punish me. And when his family came round, he acted like husband of the year. I just couldn't bear to tell him the truth. I had no one to talk to. He says I hurt him. He says he'll kill himself. I feel so guilty. He told me if I ever try to leave him. I'll cancel your visa. You'll have nowhere to go. You'll bring shame and dishonor on the family. You'll never see the kids again. I'm trapped. What have I done wrong? All it took was one person to ask me the right questions. Then I began to open up. I started to see I'm not mad. I started to see the patterns in what he did to me. 
It's taking a long time to find myself again. Yesterday, someone offered me a cup of tea and I automatically asked, am I allowed? Coercive control is against the law. It's a pattern of behaviour that's not obvious at first, but does real damage. And it's a crime. I wish there was someone I could talk to. When one person listened to me and believed me, I started to get my life back.